Yo, what's good everybody? It's Young John and today I'm going to teach y'all how to get iOS 15.0.1 on the iPhone. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go to your settings and then you're going to go to general. And I'm going to tap on where it says about at the very top so y'all can see what version I'm on right now. And I'm on 15.0 and I'm showing you how to get 15.0.1. And it just came out the same day of me recording this video, which is October 1st. So then I'm going to hit software update. And you see right there it came up. And then I keep my updates automatically off. I don't like having them set for automatic. But to make them automatic, you just hit green and green. But I'm going to shut them off. And since I had just turned them on, it just started the whole process of... Uh, updating you can see it says about 13 minutes remaining and it's asking me for my passcode so I just put it in and then I'm gonna tap where it says for more information on the security content of Apple software updates please visit this website I'm gonna tap it on that link just to show y'all what pops up So then it takes you to this page, Apple Security Updates, about Apple Security Updates for the protection of our customers. Apple doesn't disclose, discuss, or confirm security issues until an investigation has occurred or patches, blah, blah, blah. Get the latest software updates from Apple. So this website, as you keep scrolling down, it'll tell you the name of an update and the release date all the way to the right. So if you look to the right, it says 01 2021. And below that, September 23rd, 2021. So if you want to keep track of every time a new update comes out, you just got to go to this specific uh, Apple Security Updates website. So I'm just going to go home now. I go back to my settings. And this time I'm going to press where it says Learn More at the very bottom to see what comes up. not much so it fixes some settings app may incorrectly display an alert that your storage is full so if your phone recently keeps saying your storage is full and it's trying to tell you to buy some maybe updating it will fix that problem because i know for me it came up on my phone saying that my storage is full but it's really not no! I hope it fixes my problem because that's what it says it fixes. So I hope they ain't lying about it. <laughs> but yeah, now uh, we just pretty much have to wait for it to finish updating. But since this literally took me more than 20 minutes, 30 minutes to update completely, I just am going to fast forward to the point where... It's basically the next step to do once it finishes this loading part. So then I hit... Okay, here we are. It finished. Let me see. Now I'm on 15.01. And now I'm on 15.01. And that's the video, y'all. If y'all found this video helpful, make sure to hit it with a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thank y'all for watching. I'm out. Peace.